Happy Thursday, folks. It's almost the rest of, it's almost the end of the week. And as usual, we're giving God thanks for another beautiful day of sunshine. And let me just introduce to you the schools that were featured in last night's airing of Schools Challenge Quiz. The lovely ladies of Westwood High, my Jippy Jappa Gems. I love them. I love them. To, uh, if I love them one more time. And Clarendon High, Clarendon College, sorry. Fresh out of May, Penn, aka Clarendon. Yes. So, based on what I've observed thus far in the competition, of all the all girls schools that have so far um, played definitely Westwood High is the best of the lot uh, having been sorely, sorely disappointed by you know the card rate um, Jano as we say them them are the, the, the female school to beat I, I really enjoyed watching especially the captain the captain them have a star captain the what me tell you say leadership tore up orchestration tore up you know me love the style when she when they answer a question and she go good you know good i would question them wrong sometimes them answer it so confidently and so confidently and she just say good and okay it wrong so let's kick back and talk about clarendon college by the way um, Westwood High is the number 22 seeded school and Clarendon College is the 25 seeded school. Pretty much by the first, by the opening challenge, by the end of the opening challenge, um, you had an indication of how the match was going to progress in terms of the more dominant set of teams. So the opening challenge ended on... Westwood on nine, and it's a solid nine. Um, and can I tell you, these girls know how to optimize on time. They know how they do they good, especially with the, the, the speed section. They they worked it brilliantly, right? And it was car climbed on college on five. So the speed section <laughs> had uh, Clarendon had Westwood racking up 31 points, 31 solid points, and uh, Clarendon College on 17. Them whooped the gap enough, right? What I loved was the sense of urgency when the questions were being asked, because what you would find is once JP start asked the question, and I saw going to take too long, them just said, next, next, right? Clarendon College, however, they, they wasted a lot of time trying to work out Long, you know, questions that are going to take a, a good while to, to work out. Thereby not, not being more, they weren't being very efficient in, in trying to rack up as much points as they could because they were busy. And it's a strategy, people, really and truly. So, Canon College next time around. So, as so comes now... <laughs> Jamaican have the style for use the word uh, not the right context. Well, so, as so comes now, um, by the time they went into the bus around, them couldn't catch Westwood. They couldn't catch Westwood, by, um, Baba. But what I found very concerning, however, was that during almost the first two minutes of the bus around, it was pure silence and the sound of the bell. You know, like a GLP convention, beer bell a ring. Nobody now answer the question. So, ladies, we're going to need to brush up on that. And I'm hoping that they make it to the quarterfinals because, you know, they have a history. They keep booking Monroe <laughs> before they, they advance. So, may I do Father God, please, don't make them book. You know what always perplexes me? Them always lose by one point. <laughs> them always lose by one point to Monroe. Like you just see a score, you know, 35 to 34 or 
33 to 32. Something. So me had do. Me had do. God, don't make them work. <laughs> but anyway, guys, the score ended on Clarendon on seven on 13. And Westwood High on 37. As usual, I am so loving and digging your jippy jappa hats. Big up on yourself. Keep the tradition going. I love you, my ladies. And I'm rooting for you. Clarendon College walk good. I'll see you in football. Um, I'll see you in every other sport. But just not, not you this time. Maybe next season. Maybe next season. But you gave a good, you know, you gave a good performance nonetheless.